Okay, so I'm going to do a little speed comparison here between the form buttons and the ActiveX buttons. I've talked before in another video about how to use ActiveX buttons to add color to the buttons, uh, which is nice. I, I, I like the color ones because, if you can see here, you can, you can barely tell that there's a button here on these form ones. Uh, they blend in, at least on my monitor, they blend in very well. So the, the colors that give it definition to where I can see um, exactly where the button is and where it's not. But one of the drawbacks to that is that it's going to work a lot slower, these color ones. So I've set this up, and how I've done it is come into VBA, and for the uh, normal form buttons, we put the code in the, in the module. So uh, I've done that down here. I have the, the one code for the first button here, the second code for this button. And we're just saying uh, the, the range of E7, so that means cell E7 uh, dot value. So whatever the value is in, in that cell, we want it, when we click on it, we want it to return that same value except adding one. So this is going to add one with every click. And then for the uh, ActiveX buttons, we've done the, the same except we do that over here in the, uh, the object sheet. <clears throat> we come down. Once we get the button set up, we'll come down and select the button here, and then we'll come over here to click, and it's going to be the same code. So I've gotten that set up, and uh, let's go ahead and give it a shot. So first we're going to be doing the ActiveX uh, buttons. So uh, I'm going to reset this here. So I'm going to click this five times, and uh, we're going to see what number returns. Before I do that, I'm going to take it out of design mode. All right, here we go. So one, two, three, four, five. All right, so I clicked it five times, and it's on three. I'm going to do the same down here for add one for the red. I clicked it five times, and it's process three. So up here, I'm going to do the same. So I'm going to click it five times. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. So that's a big benefit for, for form buttons. It's something important to know when you're setting up a, a, a sheet, because if you have something where you know, you're building it out and uh, you add a button and w with the intention of someone clicking on it uh, repetitively, you wouldn't know that it's going to miss um, some clicks unless you've tested before um, trying, to, trying to apply it. So uh, overall conclusion would be if you need something that clicks repetitively, I would go with the form buttons and maybe... <clears throat> add a little uh, color in the background here to make those buttons stand out.